The Lagos State Police Commissioner, CP Edgar Imohimi, is one man who doesn't take crime lightly. And of course, he has simplified this uh, for the period for which he has been the Commissioner of Police in Lagos State by parading suspects and criminals here and there from time to time. Today, we are at the police command in Ikeja, the Lagos State capital, where some of these criminals will also be paraded and some of the devices recovered from them as well. We also have some ladies who were arrested for prostitution in some parts of the state and we shall be speaking with them to ask them and find out why they decided to go into prostitution. My name is Dam Larry Okonla and you're watching Nido.com TV. Please shout out to Emmanuel so the man behind the camera for bringing you this broadcast. On the 14th of December 2017, the police received a complaint from one Akin Lade Ajibola male that five armed men invaded a compound at number five Folu Lajo Olufemi Street, Barua Ipaja, Lagos, and made away with properties worth millions of Naira. The matter was recorded, and operatives of this command, as usual in collaboration with detectives of the federal SARS Ikeja, swung into action and arrested the following suspects in connection with the crime. Number one, Shima Richard, male, a.k.a. Virgin Boy, 20 years old. Abdulad Gambo, a.k.a. Magan, aged 24 years old. Najib Abubakar, male, a.k.a. Easy, 25 years old. And finally, Michael Dyer, a.k.a. Keke aged 20 years. The following exhibits were recovered from the suspects, whose areas of operation mainly are Ikpaja, Alagba, Ragu, Axis of Lagos State. Exhibits recovered from them include the following items. One locally made double barrier gun. One locally made revolver pistol, one life ammunition 9mm caliber, one cutlass, two knives, one Samsung 56 phone. What's your name? My name is Luke Furojo. Why were you arrested? Uh, uh, it's not those uh, militant boys that is working at, at that marine. They arrest me. Even that is how uh, I do find snail for my survival. I find snail in the bush, I sell. But I come and visit them. So they just say that uh, uh, they, they arrest one uh, Akwebi that he mentioned my name, that I follow him. Why he kidnapped somebody at Itoki? Uh, I said I did not kidnap anybody at Itoki, so let him come and prove me how I follow him. So that was how they arrest me. And Agbala is the ogre of that boy that do the kidnapping. And that day that the thing happened, to God who created heaven and earth, I was in the village. I carried my wife down to that place because which village? Itoke village. So I carried my wife down there to in order to take care of the pregnancy. So please, I want government to look into this matter. So I, I don't know, maybe it's my spirit that go there. So I want government to look into it very well. And what of these guns? Where did they see these guns? Did they meet these guns? No, sir. I don't have anything like gun at all. I don't know how did they this gun come from. They said this, it, uh, this boy beside me that do do a vigilante group. Uh -huh. They got the gun. Yes, they say you know, it's vigilante that got it, but I don't know how this thing come from. What's your name? Sunday. Sunday. How old are you? I'm um, 19 years. Where are you from? Songwata. What happened? Why are you here? Why did they bring you? Um, is this my friend Lekon? So, he, he's, he's big lad and I'm a carpenter also. So, we are from the same place in Songwata. So we went to work in Lekki. So that's why he gets to meet Emmanuel. So unfortunately, we went to work that day. We don't see work, sir. So night has come. So we are chasing by security. So we, are, we now enter one uncompleted building. But this one is fighting with the security. So they're not chasing us with cutlass, everything. So we now went to one uncompleted building. They entered the uncompleted building. So now jump to another fence. So that place, 
all this, the security said we are guards here. So they now said we should this one, you know how to drive. So we now see the motor, we now see one car there. But there is car key is there, so we now start you know how to drive. We now start the motor. So that's why we escaped there, sir. You took the car to move it. Yes. So the the day that I've tell him already to go and return the car. But the, I'm not we are not together again. What kind of car is it? Toyota Avalon. Avalon. Yeah. So and it's a new car. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So we are not together again. So um, I don't know maybe the second day he said he want to return the car that the day when he's going to return the car. The arrest him, sir. Police arrest him. So he come to that uh, that that place is some water. So um, as they arrest him, they bail him there. He sell his phone, I don't know, sir. They just bail him there. So the when he wants to come and collect the car, so I told him that this car, you know, we take it to escape these people. So he should go and return the, the car. When they so, arrest him with the car. So, so we can't to leave it so people who owns it, they will be able to get it through the station board. He said if he do, if he drop it here, yeah, people who owns it may not be able to find it that he should come and collect it. So why why didn't you return the car? Okay, who is the person? So what happened? Why what happened with the car? Yeah, after just yes, explain everything. When we tried to return the car, so I was arrested on my way to return the car. Because the car, well, I do not have, we do not have intention to steal the car. Because we don't, I don't do anything about that. I only do my work. My work is stand floor. So when the work we, is what? Stand floor. Stand floor. So all, we just want to return. At that process, they arrest me. So there is nothing, there is no way out. So Why did you take the car in the first place? Just to, because um, the security just... The security was pushing us. So someone else's car. Yeah. So just to save us that night. So we now go. So the next day. You didn't have intention of selling the car. Never, never. So that was what happened. So when we got in here. So they now asked me about everything. So I told them. So that was what really happened. So I now have intention to sell the car or to do. All I need is. Just to save us, because that night, if the OPC could cut us, they would kill us. So that's what. How old are you? I'm 24 years. I'm 24.